Red again. <laughs> I love this girl. Good morning, afternoon, or evening. What is up? My name is Marta. That is Ilona and Jason. Welcome to the vlog. Welcome to Volus Vibes. Welcome to uh, a great day. Literally, like yesterday and uh, the, like the last four or five days, it has been great days. Like now I have enough light also on my face, you know, it's a little bit of light that we get in our house. We have a rather dark house now, honestly. It doesn't yeah. look that dark sometimes because on camera, there's like one big dark hole in the back there. Because when I turn like this, you'll immediately see that it is dark in this house. And uh, we, we need a, little, a lot of lamps, but we have a lot of like warm light. Anyway, boring information. So you might ask, what is this big wooden board with legs doing in our house? Or you might say, Hey, did you buy me something new? Eh? Yeah. Did you spend again money on me? <laughs> did you spend again money on me? Well, let's get back to about 15 minutes ago that uh, we stepped into the car. So, we're sitting in the X-Trail, which is by the... Oh, so loud, that beep. It's the beep from driving backwards. We're sitting in the, the Nissan x -Trail because my parents and I, we changed yesterday the car. And we are going after... To spend some money. We're going to spend some money, yeah. You're gonna act like we're rich, bit. I don't have to lock the car all the time now, but uh, we can just push the button and it's locked. Uh, we're not even spending our money. You're spending, you're spending your grandparents' money, huh? Yeah, because your grandpa and grandma from the Netherlands, they said we should buy some stuff that they need. And also your dad, right? So your other grandpa also, he wants to buy something for him. And yesterday we already checked the store out here uh, at Jumbo, it's called Bimbo. By the way, that means a very funny word in Dutch. It's like something like slutty, but it's in Dutch. Bimbo, someone with like big boobs and all. Anyway, and uh, we saw some stuff last evening already here that we really liked and we thought, okay, we can buy this then. So that's what we're gonna do, right? Yep. It's nice gifts. Gifts that are necessary, Jason. Gifts that are necessary, boy. Yes. So this is also the other one that we wanted. It has a mosquito net and it has a Alex Sierra and it has a bed. Right? Yep. And, yeah, all the... and there's a little train okay. on the side. And the other thing that we want in the after yeah. to park. To bless, to oyster bleto. To bless? To bless. No. So we're gonna you're gonna sit in this thing here, dude. You like it? You like this kickaboo? Can you sit in it now? The other one that we have right now is until uh, 9 kilos, 10 kilos. 10 kilos and this one that we're buying right now is until 18 kilos. And it can lay back and everything, so it's a nice one. Right? Yeah. Thanks, Grandpa. Grand Thanks, Grandpa, Grandma. Eh? You think I'm going to Uh, I think that was the fastest money we've ever spent, yeah. like in in one baby store. <laughs> a decent amount of money. Yeah. Yeah. One hundred and forty-four. No. My parents and one hundred and seventy-four your grandpa. I hope so. I don't know. Do you want to go to Ah, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. We got this to sit up in <laughs> These guys at the traffic lights, they always greet you so nice. They always give you a smile. They clean your windshield or something, or they offer you like tissues. Eh, some of the sometimes I give them something, sometimes I don't. I mean, when I come with the Jimmy, always though, he's like, so oh, yeah. He recognizes you. He recognizes you. Yeah. Yeah, but I have the chair next to me. Maybe he thought that I was a kid in there. Ah, he knows that I'm the only weird Dutch guy that actually gives money. <laughs> hey, Kukushana, привет! Jason, hey! We've got a new car seat for you, huh? And a new play thingy. But you don't care, you only care about your legs. About your feet, huh? How to punch things. So that is what this big thing is. It is something for Jason to uh, start working out in. My phone in the background is like playing me. Hey, see? 
Sergio and Renee. Check them out, by the way. I'll put a little link up here. They're Dutch vloggers, so if you don't speak Dutch, it's a little bit difficult, but I've been following lately and... Uh, they have a cute baby. They have a cute baby, just like Jason, but Jason is cuter. Sorry, Jesse. <laughs> <laughs> For the ones who watch regularly, uh, usually here is the table standing. I've put the table to the side right now. Ilona hates it. I love it. I wanted to need to make some space, actually, to put this here, and we need to do some cable management back here in the corner. You didn't say it correctly. You hated it. Ilona hates it, I love it, therefore it's gonna go back in place today. But this thing, it's big. Like, it's really big. Our uh, pediatrician told us to buy this because he can, uh, Jason can grab his hands into this and like strengthen up his muscles and pull himself up because he already sits very good. But I think I just do like this. Ooh! Wow! Now that's it. I need to stick in there. Yeah, yeah. And the last one, uh, clack. That's it. Personally, we are not too much into like dog bear thingies and all like this. We don't, we're not big. This color, for example, it matches with our wall. We hate the color on this wall. It is beige. Yeah. But because like... It's a rental apartment and we're not going to do anything about this house. This is the only wall that we painted in, in the bedroom. This was the most acceptable in, a, in all honesty of all, right? This plastic needs to stay on, I believe. Yeah? Yeah, I don't know. I'm not sure. It's also hard to get off, but it's good for him to like... Yeah. Drool on if he wants to. Mm -hmm. Should we put him in there? It is... It is, I don't know, horrible. Look, but it's more important. Look, 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 look. Oh, he found a bag. He has so many toys and he's eating a bag. Jason. Oh, hey. It's like a prison. It is a prison. Toys, Papa. Toys. Are we gonna fall over? Yes. We probably are. Hi. Ooh, there we go. And that's why the net is there. Oh, that's so scary for the <laughs> wall. No, the, he won't be able to hit, that's the thing, he won't be able to hit the walls or these pipes that are here sticking out, for example. This is just for him to chill in, but he can get a little bit grumpy right now because this is not the most, most comfortable position, I guess. <laughs> this is literally for him to start pulling himself up and work out and all that kind of stuff. And throw all his toys in. That's also something that the pediatrician said. Yeah, you could. You the nice thing about house? this, if you want to clean your house, you just, everything, the toys and all that kind of stuff, you just dump in there. Even even the relaxer that we have standing there right now. No. He's not, he doesn't need it in a while anymore because he'll be able to straight up set. Uh, he will be able to sit up straight. In this actually, but everything you can just dump in here. He has more space to roll over and everything. It's a big, big playground for you, huh? But it's not a bed, because that's also something we bought. The bed we'll show you another time, because you already saw it in the store also. But we got it in a box and it was a very nice combination pack of like a... Oh, Durak finds it very interesting. Let's see what Durak does, because he's like, what the hell is this and why is there a baby in there? Mm -hmm. Durak and Jason in general, they go together okay. Durak does not want to have to do too many things with Jason, but he does like the smell and Jason loves Durak. So, it is nice, of course, that uh, we get so many presents because it helps us, it helps Jason uh, in growing up, but it's normal from your, from his grandpa and grandma. I have a stain on my nipple and I don't know how it get. I thought I, could, I, took, I put on something clean. You see that? That's not what you want. Anyway, getting presents is nice, but grandpa, grandma, it's very normal to get presents from that. that or normal, it is nice, if, especially nice. If, I don't know, it's a little bit normal. Let's put it like that, it's normal. For the ones who are new to this channel, who don't know that Ilona, let me also for a second to shave this nasty thing off. I didn't know that at your 30 second you still had zits. So before Ilona took her days off, actually for her pregnancy and all that kind of stuff for Jason to be born, there was a guy coming over, we called him the golden grandpa or something. Uh, he would come over every Monday at her work and bring her presents like cookies or cake or fresh olive oil or fresh fruits and vegetables and all that kind of stuff. And uh, yeah, <laughs> we never really understood why. Actually, at one point I came by because he wanted to hand Ilona a phone because it was a little bit difficult to contact her sometimes when she was at work. Ilona made clear when I'm at work, I, uh, I, I'm at work, literally. It's not time to do some, I don't know, have a phone call for all the time. You can call me at the store if you want to. And at that point, I was a little bit like freaked out in all honesty. Why does a 70 year old guy or something want to get, gift a phone? But we found out that it was actually with really good intent. It was really not that he did not, he didn't mean anything bad. I came over one time, I wanted to meet him because I didn't meet him before that yet. And I made him clear in a kind of funny way or serious way as well to not like screw around and 
I don't know, do weird things. Since then, things have been very nice actually. Every time uh, he like gave something for me as well, he like made cookies still, he did the same thing, nothing really changed. Uh, and we decided last time to actually meet up with him. I don't know if more guys, by the way, if you do this, but I like to get it out of my beard with the back of my razor so it's faster, I don't know. Or I can just wash it out, one second. So we're not related or something, but we decided to meet him up, uh, meet up with him outside of work as well, outside of Ilona's work, because she was now having her days off. It's a very nice guy, he has the very nice stories to tell always, so yeah, why not? So that's what we're gonna do right now. We're gonna meet up with uh, this golden grandpa who's not related really, but still, we're gonna meet up with him. First I need to uh, change my shirt. Also, we, we don't ever put him really in the vlogs because we don't know if he wants to, and uh, yeah. I never really asked, asked them anything. Maybe we'll ask him this time. Anyway, change my shirt, do my hair, or put some gel in there. Let's go. How long have you known the grandpa right now? How long ago was it that you met him the first time? Three years, four. Three years? Yeah, or four. Hmm. I forgot to mention that it is not bad or something. It's actually good to have people like this around because they help you out during life. And the best thing is actually that he does not want anything in return always. Huh? He, we gave him sometimes some stuff from the outside, like he bakes cookies, for example. Uh, Ilona's grandma made him all kinds of sweets and to like thank. And, but in other ways, he never really wants anything in return. He just invited us over all the time to come have a drink, for example, in Agria. But we'll see, maybe in the future. Agria, right? Or no, uh, Afisha. Afisha, okay, Afisha. But for now, we're just going to go in our own little neighborhood here to have a little cup, cup of coffee until you go back to work, right? What are you shouting at, kids? Yeah, so uh, do you remember what I said a couple of vlogs back? I said, uh, and of course, don't ever forget an extra battery when you're a vlogger. So literally we just forgot to take an extra battery because I didn't know that this battery was almost dead because I didn't check the screen actually because our screen is flipped upside down I need to fix it and I'm actually gonna do it now Finally! Uh, for that safety case actually uh, because we're just gonna eat now Wait. Jola, I don't need to do anything else Ilona's gonna do some work <laughs> Jason Whoa. Uh. I have my phone and everything. I, you have your phone? Yeah, you have our baby in your hands. As usual, we've got from, uh, we call him the grandpa. It's not our grandpa at all, but the grandpa, and he had this. Uh, he's not that old. He's about 50 something. No, he's 60 something. No. He's pensioner. He's 67 at least. So I believe he's actually hitting the 70s. Anyway, uh, all these are chocolate filled or Damascus covered by chocolate. Damascus fruit. Yeah, with uh, couverture. Pure chocolate. Dura. And he said, uh, he said he did couverture because of Ilona's I chocolate know. allergy, uh, milk. milk allergy, Not or Ilona. Jason's milk allergy, yeah. But also in couverture is milk powder. So uh, literally in anything that you'll, well, there must be somewhere chocolate also without any milk, but that's pure cacao. And that's what we already have with our tahini. And we put a little bit of like honey in there in our tahini. Sesame paste is tahini for the ones who do not know it's like peanut butter but out of sesame seeds i'm gonna try to fix my camera because i still see myself wait i'll show you guys so this is the this is my camera right it's a panasonic g7 and i'm very happy with it but as you can see like I, it's hard for me to aim right now this cam this screen is upside down this is inception people this is vlogception for anyone, everybody who has ever said vlogception this is vlogception my white balance completely messes up right away right now because the wall, wall behind us is not yellow but white see uh, changes. I need to fix that because also when I now like flip the screen, it is correct the correct size actually. It's the correct way up. It's not upside down. But when I close it, it completely turns off also. So I need to open the camera. <sighs> I'm going to film it with Ilona's phone, trying to film anything, something. You look beautiful by the way today. Ilona has her hot hair up by the way. I like it like this because Jason likes to pull it. Yeah, but that's better. Do it again so I can put that music underneath. Ready? Wait. <laughs> Ready again? <laughs> I love this girl. The most unsexy. I love thing that girl. Ever. It is not about that. Jason, I love your mom. You're having fun in your new parko. Well, you know what Jason likes? What does he like? Jason! Ding, ding, ding. <laughs> hey, Jason. Hey. I think we have a meta 
it's a very very long outro becoming it like this if you like this vlog don't forget to hit the thumbs up button leave a comment down below because we love to read them and we always reply me too, me too. thank you for watching and we'll see you next bye. one bye bye bye